na 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 what does that stand for, kids? Who knows what that man named S-T-A-R-T stands for? I'm guessing he stands for justice. Like Batman. So you play as Batman. Well, Christian Bale's Batman. Because this is based on the movie that was released in 2005. Called Batman Begins. 2005, that's like the future, man. That's like the... How can something come out in the future and the past at the same time? Well... Technically, when you think about it, everything we see and hear comes into our reality milliseconds before our brains can interpret it. So, really, we're all living in the past, but it's our present. I just blew all your mind's penises just now. Your mind penises. Your mind penis. So, yeah, Christian Bale's Batman. Uh, if you're a fan of this atrocity of a portrayal, then you'll probably like this game. Let me out! The walls! Please! I, I, I can't you stand this! when you talk. Please! Anything! Just let me out! I want to know about bears and rabbits. But personally, I think his voice sounds like 9-11. The game follows the movie pretty loyally, like a good Labrador. Without too much filler. Although there are some scarecrow fights that don't happen in the movie, but this is a game, so they have to put them in somewhere, you know. Like the more modern series, the Arkham series, fear plays a role in the gameplay. So before you encounter a group of enemies, it gives you a chance to almost solve a sort of puzzle on how to scare them, so you can attack the one with the, the guns and uh, you can strategize on who to take out first. So it's like the base, basic, basic, uh, all your favorite actors are facing the microphone, going, doing their real voices, going, I'm Batman, you leave Rachel out of this. <laughs> I always like it when, uh, I always like it when um, actors, behind the scenes in these PS2 era games talk about behind the scenes and how they're excited about being in this modern game because the graphics are so good and da -da. <laughs> yeah. they still are good but it's just funny it's like old people getting excited to see the first car oh, one of them metal horses ah oh, old people Age happens to all of us, loves. Get used to it. Get used to wrinkly nipples. The graphics <sighs> blew me away. <laughs> the atmosphere was depressing and brooding and sad and and uh, and uh, uh, and dark. And dark is how I like my coffee and my Batman. Not racist. Isn't the right time to talk about race, is it? <laughs> Timing isn't impeccable as you always say. <laughs> so sometimes as you're going through the game, you'll come across some locked doors. And these are doors that you can't open because they're locked. So you need to find a guard. Ooh, where's a guard? Where's a guard? You find one and then you interrogate them by pressing a button, which is the ultimate interrogation experience. Do your worst. You'll get nothing from me. You're wasting your time. Falcone's already got me scared. There's nothing you can do to me. It's fun, you should try it. I mean interrogating someone dressed as a bat, not this game. <laughs> no, try this game. It's, it's fun, no, it's fun. Yeah, try, try the game. Um, try playing the game while interrogating someone dressed as a bat. 
you dressed as the bat, not the other person dressed. Well, you could be both dressed as bats. You could be a, a, a... Actually, all of this would be pretty much impossible because unlike modern games, this game doesn't play itself. <laughs> Batman gets really happy when he gets a key. <laughs> I don't get that happy when I find him. Maybe because I take them for granted, never take a key for granted. Combat is fun with all the gadgets and the uh, Batman and Batman, you're Batman! You've got gadgets and stuff and grappling, you're doing the vent thing. No, it's fun. It's good, it's good stuff. It's a little funny seeing how many times Batman actually climbs ladders when he could just uh, use a grappling hook like a normal Batman. He climbs the ladder exactly how Christian Bale's Batman voice would climb a ladder. <laughs> There's something awkward about this game when there are moments where you have to watch Batman's dark brooding vigilante waiting for an elevator. <laughs> He's a patient guy. He'll wait. This game is fun, especially if you're a fan of the game. <laughs> Even if you're not a fan of this style of Batman, if you just like Batman in general and you just... you like puzzles and these kind of adventure games and combat beat-em-ups and stuff like that, you, li you, will, uh, you will like it. Who doesn't like a puzzle? Hey! Oh, who's up there? Who's, who's the negative Nancy Nelly? Who's the negative nanny? Negative nanny. Hey, 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 hey. What drugs am I on today? <laughs> I fucking like them in my drugs. The voice acting isn't phenomenal, but at least the original actors are, you know, in the game. Mr. Kane, you couldn't done better, mate. You couldn't done better. This is my Michael Kane accent. It's terrible. I'm terrible. <laughs> what the f- uh, <laughs> the, the game is cheap as, so have a blast. Subscribe! Might as well screw this one up as well. So, so screw everything up. <laughs>